behind the chimney and the ridge cap right here is a full size ridge cap but for some reason they didn't want to put it in back of the chimney you see this ridge cap here it's a ventilating ridge cap and it's solid and it's rigid and it has a cone inside of it and it shingles over it and right here they just went to standard shingles the problem is there's flat spots look See how flat it is here compared to here how it humps and it's secure I mean it's sound here this is a little bit uh, soft in a flat spot to hold water shingles aren't made to hold water like that this isn't the right way to do it and there's a gap underneath here like there's like the wood doesn't come all the way up and it depresses I don't trust this cap this needs to be completely recovered right here on this uh, area behind the chimney. This isn't adequate to have these flat spots there for the water to rest in little pockets up here. It doesn't look like it's resting, but it is here. That's where your leak is too. So that could be in a heavy rain that the water gets through there and goes right through, let alone the chimney that was all falling apart. So there you go. Definitely needs a ridge cap installed there for about eight feet okay let me know if you want that done